Before I show off the new things, I'm going to show off the two tapes I forgot to show in previous update. Y'all yeah, remember that moldy tape uh, DK sent me uh, a while back to clean? Well, this is what he sent me as a thank you for cleaning his tape off. Which, that has been done by the way, and I've already sent it back. Looks like it was printed on October 20th, 2005. So, this is a reprint. This tape came out in 2004. And here's one I got from a YouTube friend of mine, who also happens to be a Discord friend of mine. This comes from YouTuber uh, Splendid Engine 21. Okay, Jeremy. If you're watching, my dude, thank you so much for sending me out this tape. And y'all might be thinking, why did he send this out to you? If you already have a copy of this tape, well, it's because this is actually a much rarer release than the one that I have. My my copy of the tape I have is a blue cassette, but not only that, it's no the original. This is a different version, a Kmart uh, mastering tape, with, you know, set of different title card variants. So that's why I got this off of him. This one's actually a black tape. Again, the other copy I currently have is a blue tape. No print date. I have checked it, and it is indeed different than the blue copy I have so thanks again Splendid Engine 21 if you're watching thanks for sending me out this tape y'all are more than welcome to check out his YouTube channel these are his channels right here Splendid Engine 21 which is the one he uses mostly and there's Random Kid Entertainment he doesn't use that as much though so yep thanks again my dude if you're watching for this tape Thanks again. Nice of you to send that out to me. Now for the new stuff I've recently bought. Speaking of DK, I uh, DK's Media Central Returns, I also bought this tape off of his eBay page. June 16, 1999. <clears throat> Bought this on September 29th. Arrived on October 3rd. And he sent me a note for it too, so I'll go ahead and read it off here. <clears throat> Fancy meeting you here once again, SpongeBob. JK, bro. <laughs> Thank you very much for your business once again. And it's my honor to be friends with someone who shares my interests. Remember, God made you special, and he loves you very much. Your friend, D David Nucky, DK's Video Central. P.S. Bob is really angry. I hope he doesn't catch me. It's so hard to run with this umbrella on my head. Nah, Veggie Tales, uh, silly song. <sighs> Thanks again, DK, for that tape, and, uh, this one too. I forwarded this one on October 3rd. Although, for this one, this is actually the original uh, label. This was printed on the 318th day of 1996 and the 319th day of 1996. You cannot see this one, but this one you can. I also got these two in the form of a two-tape set. 
those are the original copies. These are reprint copies. Wow. Let's clean this one. But these copies are pretty hard to find, these uh, Lyric Studios boxes. So glad to have these finally. Forwarded this one on October 1st. This one arrived on October 8th. This is a very, very VeggieTales Stars tape. I believe there's one other which is uh, Flibberaloo. I still need to find that. Cost me about $25. So, not bad overall. And this one does. Wait. No. Actually. What's this? Okay, uh uh. No print date. Here's something I've shown you on my community tab. This one arrived on the 17th. This one actually took a little bit longer to ship. And that's because the seller uh, I bought this from had issues uh, with his mother-in-law being in a hospital, so that's why it was shipped out a little bit late, but got it in nonetheless. And I hope everything with the seller goes well. <clears throat> I'll show those off in a second. There's no print dates on these tapes. Okay, so tape one is the movie and tape two is the extras. The movie on this VHS is actually in widescreen, which is cool. Here's this booklet. I'm gonna flip through this quickly. Came with two of these. They're the same. This is a really nice case too. Pretty cool. I'll be watching this movie sometime next week, I hope. I pointed out this one to y'all on my community tab. Yep, a new Kid Songs image in a Tim and VHS release for the collection. This is the 2003 VHS of Meet the Biggles. I had to buy it off of a lot bundle, which I bought the bundle on eBay on October 16th. And arrived on October 20th. October 20th. No print date. Black reels, but it don't squeak, which is good. And here are the tapes that I'm gonna be getting rid of. Well, not this one. First off, here's my. This one's actually got the Kid Vision copy inside this case. It looks like the Warner Reprise print, but I checked it and it is the Kid Vision copy. Although, on eBay I see an actual Kid Vision case right here, but inside it it's got the Viewmaster inside. Viewmaster copy. You know what? I'm going to buy that right now, actually. I got the money for it, so... So the reason why I'm keeping this one is because this is the actual image entertainment tape. 
And the case on this one's actually in much better condition, too. Uh, than this one. This one had to be taped up and all, it's a little... Sun faded too, but not as bad. But. Yep. I'll buy that after the video. After I'm done. Got a bunch more promotional tapes. I ordered this one on, on October 15th. This right on the 20th. Two print dates, October 23rd, 2000, and the 44th week of 2000. Now here's something I thought would never exist. I haven't seen any of these up until now. A promotional copy of Blue's Clues, Blue's Big Musical Movie. Yep. This tape was actually brand new when I bought it. <clears throat> Only cost me about $20. Again, this one was brand new and sealed. Pretty good find overall. This one arrived yesterday. Two print dates again. June 22nd, 2000. And 27th week of 2000. I forwarded this one on October 18th, along with this next one. Although I got this one today. Print on January 4th, 2000 and May 9th, 2000. Ordered this DVD from eBay on October 2nd. This one arrived on uh, October 11th. Follow these three from my personal text. At Paso, Texas yesterday. I drove out there. I said I was going to drive out there the other day, and I did. Bought this one from Walmart. I saw this movie in theaters. Not a lot of people like this movie. But I enjoyed it. So that's why I bought it. I have everything but the Paw Patrol movie. Honestly, I mean, I don't know if I'm gonna get that. <clears throat> oh, these two I bought from Target. Unfortunately, these were movies I didn't get to see in theaters. So that's why I bought them. Hoping to check these movies out someday. These two I missed out seeing in theaters.
This is actually a movie that uh, has Dwayne Johnson and Kevin Hart in it. Just like Central Intelligence. So I think I'm going to like this one. Because I also do like Central Intelligence. I have that on DVD. That is a very funny movie.